Hello everybody, this is Jamie Thompson from EdUp and in today's Toolbox Talk we're going to be talking to Andrew Gabb. Andrew is the HSC manager for BP Chargemaster and BP Chargemaster is one of the biggest names in the UK for electric vehicle charging solutions. They provide the fastest and most convenient network uh, across the UK and uh, they're a growing business uh, which are trusted by a network of electric vehicle drivers, businesses uh, and also local authorities. So uh, great business doing great things and Andrew's been kind enough to share his reflections on getting started with EdApp, uh, the business case of micro learning which uh, I gather his CEO uh, is enthused about uh, and also some great tips on getting started. So we hope you enjoy the session and uh, as always we look forward to getting your feedback afterwards. Thank you. Hi Andrew. Hi Jamie. How are you doing today? Yeah, good. Beautiful day. <laughs> good, good. So, Andrew, thank you very much for, for joining us on this session, this Toolbox Talk today. Um, if you could just start off by just sharing uh, a little bit about you, uh, your role, uh, and also BP Charge Master for us, please. Sure. Well, uh, I'm Andrew Gabb. I'm HSE Manager for BP Charge Master. Uh, we're a division of BP. And we're the largest um, installer of electric vehicle chargers in the country. We've got about 400 and rising in the workforce. We're quite involved and important in BP's um, commitment to zero carbon emissions by 2050. So like I say, HSE. So we oversee all the health and safety, quality, environmental. We support and we advise. Mm. <laughs> Great. And um, so you're a relatively recent uh, adopter of, of micro learning. Can you just share a little bit about, uh, first of all, I guess, what, what led you to, to start uh, investigating that as, as a potential training option? Uh, and then uh, a little bit about how and, and, and why you're using that. During the lockdown, we were taking the opportunity to catch up on the awareness training sessions with, uh, with a load of the workforce remotely through Microsoft Teams. These guys are all over the country, so it's not, it's not an easy ask. We spent half a day with each uh, group of 20, delivering the sessions, getting the feedback, and, and blah, blah, blah. It was good, but it was, it was difficult. It's hard going. So all of this led me to think, how, how can we change this? How can we be smarter? Just at the right time, EdUp popped up on my auditor. Uh, yeah expression of interest i clicked the button straight away they got in touch um demonstrated it and i said this could be a real goer for us so i took a group of 10 as a trial once i got the first two or three on uh yeah. into it on boarded um word spread i mean i i, I offered a 20 pound uh, amazon voucher as a reward <laughs> as well um that seemed to work yeah but but that and, and word of mouth between between the guys, it sort of spread. So yeah. so it took off quite quickly then, um, yeah. and it was it was really successful, and and the feedback has been so positive from them. Time, the time that we can save, um, is is incredible. Right. Um, looking at it, um, the money as well. I've talked to our CEO. He's all on board. I mean, straight away, he could see the benefits with the time and the money saving. I've talked to our HR department because I think they can use this resource um, extremely well uh, with the same benefits as, you know, our health and safety team. Yeah. yeah. If we developed packages through, uh, through EDAM, there's no reason some of the components could be done before um, they actually attend um, yeah. attend the induction, um, and I believe we could we could knock over half a day down to maybe an hour face to face. Yeah, so it's um, it it speaks for itself. I mean, it's exciting. It really is. Probably one of the best things that I came across was the ability to upload a PowerPoint yeah. and EDAP will automatically give you a rough draft. It's not perfect, but it does a pretty good job from that PowerPoint. Yeah. The first draft of a, uh, of a training session is the hardest. As soon as you get that first one done, it's, it's happy days. It, you're just plain sailing. So yeah, that is my mm -hmm. one, 
my one piece of advice. Um, also, don't don't be frightened of it. It's it's fun. Mm. All right. Well, look, Andrew, thank you so much for your time. Uh, it's been a real pleasure talking to you, and uh, I hope that everyone has enjoyed the session. And uh, we look forward to to hearing from you. Uh, again soon. Andrew, keep up the good work. Uh, we look forward to, to following your exciting uh, sure. month journey. Awesome. Thanks, Jamie. Thank you.